We're down here at Sebring, and we've come to, well, a little different part of the Sebring show to look at Tectum in all its glory. I'm Dan Johnson. I'm talking with Shannon Yeager here. You're the manager of this new facility here. Uh, let's do a little summary first. Sure. How did you happen to get here? You got here and you announced this at the Sun and Fun show a few months ago, so now you got a few months' time in place. Tell us a little bit about what the facility has done for Technum and uh, what you can provide here in the way of services to customers. Sure. Well, the best part about us actually being here is we have a nice big toehold for the Italian corporations. The Italian company owns this building. Ah, okay. Facilities. So this is not a U.S. import operation no, here. No. This is the company. This is the actual factory. You know, and our, our long-range vision is to go ahead and do manufacturing here as well. Is that right? That okay. is. That is. So what we have to do to start off with is our initial part is we're able to do this is our true showroom. We're maintaining uh, one of each of the models of aircraft here all the time. So anybody around the country, you know, we're, we're willing to bring them in here and make sure they have an opportunity to see side by side our different models, both our certified and our LSAs. So it's really been able to support us there. Additionally, we were able to add in our parts components. So now we keep uh, $12 million worth of parts here right behind us and then those black, yeah, black kind of parts the, back it, in there. It, uh, upper shelf there sort upper of Upper shelf, lower shelf, yeah, we got a few here because our goal here is to get to that customer support level of 24-hour turnaround times on the parts. Because we know that, you know, we want to make sure... It's a big deal for insurance companies, I know. They huge. need to know they're going to be able to repair the thing. And so when I was up there, you even got whole sections of wing panels and we stuff. We do. We've got skins, we've got leading edges because we know sometimes hangar rash happens, doesn't it? And we got to use that hangar ash and, and, and take care of it quick because nobody wants to have their aircraft down. And, and that reflects on the company as well that we've made the investment to be here and, and to support our customers in the United States. Okay, so we're at the Sebring Airport. I'm going to kind of motion that way because that's where the airport terminal is yep. right there. So like the next building over, yep. the big new facility they put in a few years ago. It makes back. lunch easy, by the way. And it does. Right They've got a restaurant right there. So it's, Sebring has become from, oh, let's say 15 years ago, it's kind of a little kind of a shabby beaten up airport and Mike <laughs> Willingham and his team came in here and did some wonderful things and then this building got built and it was used by another company and now you guys are in this facility and doing this with all these airplanes and we're gonna go around and look at some airplanes we're standing in front of the new Astori, the sort of the newest of the fleet for mm -hmm. uh, Technum and uh, that makes me want to ask if this is a gorgeous airplane we'll look some more detail in it but you've now been here almost a whole year not quite a year, but close to a year. How's 2014 been for you? 2014 really turned out to be an exceptional year. Uh, we came into the facility about halfway through the year. So, but we already saw our trajectory starting to begin. You know, I really feel like the market's actually turning the corner. I'm seeing more people coming back into the market, really playing and, and showing up to actually buy aircraft. So it's been very exciting. And we're actually showing a real increase in business for two things. One is, again, because I have the aircraft here they can see side by side, which is mm -hmm. very important to actually fly it, spend the time with yeah, the customer. Yeah, right out the door and go fly. Roll out the door and go fly. And then, you know what, maybe I did want that low wing, and we're going to take a look at that as well. And then we also have that, that 1090 program where we're only asking them to outlay 10% of the money up front until we build the aircraft, bring it here, have the C of A, and say, it's yours. And that's real important for... You know, some people feel a little uncomfortable. Maybe my money's going overseas somewhere. I don't know where it is. You know what? We just want to make sure that you're serious. We can finance our own build process. And then we're going to bring it here and make sure that, that you feel comfortable with the whole thing. Again, with our support and our, our parts that are available here as well. So let's review that a little bit, the 1090 program, which I think uh, when you first announced it, I thought that's a, it's what we call a game changer. Now, that phrase has been overused to death. But uh, in this case, I felt like it really was very significant. Uh, it, the product is built in Italy, so it is overseas, mm -hmm. and even if it's a very well-established and well-known company, it's still a long way to send your money, and usually with many companies, and no disrespect to those companies, but there's usually quite a wait. Mm -hmm. And there may be for this product as well, depending on what the situation is, but you're out 10% of the cost, so let's just take a number of $150,000, you're only out fifteen grand on that airplane, and then it comes here and they can put the key in and, and, and fly it away. Well, given flight training and things like that, but if, the, if those are in place, they can go and give you the 90% just before they do. That's that, That's it, right? You have the opportunity to come in, have a look, you have 30 days from when I say the aircraft is ready to fly. You can come in and take a look at it. You can go as a passenger in the flight. I have to fly because Technum technically is responsible for the aircraft and ensuring it. You can go up for a little flight to make sure that it is built the way that you expected it to be built. And then we'll do the transaction at the end. So I'm not asking you to really put 
all that 90% faith until you physically see the aircraft, you can go take it up in the air. I think that's real significant, Shannon. I it think is. that's a. Uh, I suspect it, the market, I'm glad to hear you feel it's uh, looking stronger. It seems that way to me, too. These things are always sort of subjective because we don't have a lot of ways to hard measure that stuff until some time has passed. So we may not know for sure how good the year was until a couple of years hence. But, um, but I've been hearing that from a number of different quarters. But in your experiences, you've been delivering and selling airplanes this year. We definitely and have. And a big improvement from, from some prior years when it wasn't as strong as it has been this year. That's correct. That's right? I think we, we've seen almost a, a doubling. Wow. Of, of what we were doing previously. And I think, again, the combination of a real physical presence in, in the United States as an investment from the company, uh, making sure that 10 to 1090 program, I think, really was, was significant. That's a big deal. Mm -hmm. So my second visit down here with you, Shannon, and I'm real impressed. It's exciting to see this kind of involvement here. Technum U.S. Inc., is that That's correct? That's correct. Technum right, U.S. Incorporated. And so you've given us some information about the facility. We want to invite people to come down and visit you here and check out the airplanes more and, and visit Sebring and the doing. How do they find you on the web? How do we find you in Florida? Well, on the web, it's going to be www.technum. And remember, there's no H in there. Technum.com. You can also come to Kilo Sierra Echo Fox Truck. Come on down to KSEF Sebring Airport. We're right here by the FBO. You can ring our doorbell. We're more than happy to take you around, take a look inside the hangar. And of course, if, if need be, we might go flying. Good stuff. Lots more stuff about available aircraft and available aviation on my website, bydanjohnson.com. Thanks a lot for joining Shannon Yeager and myself here at Sebring.